Hello and welcome back to the channel. It's me, Silent Knight, and in this video, I am joined by Volker Saurus, one of the best PVM players in Dovus. In this video, I am actually going to join him in his uh, Four Horsemen dungeon leeching service. Um, he actually has a way to do all of the achievements possible in one dungeon run. Uh, you see here me playing my turn one. Basically, I have to hit a lot to, to get the poison on me, so I die on turn one, and it will not fail the impertinent uh, achievement. So basically, he has his own strategy. He recently uploaded the video as well, where he explains how he runs this dungeon. Um, so it's at uh, the moment this video gets uploaded it's all probably already a couple of weeks ago since I have done this so but yeah I waited for him to upload his video so I could upload this as well now the way he basically does this is he throws misery into the middle cell of the map so Misery basically cannot move for the entire fight. And he is using his second panda to uh, lock corruption basically, you will see in a, in a minute. And then he only uses his main panda and sedida to focus off the monsters one by one basically, which is pretty insane if you ask me. Now the reason I actually paid him to leech me through this dungeon and do all the achievements in one run is basically because I don't think I'll ever be able to do the achievements for this dungeon. Now possibly I might be able to do quartet and even freedom but I don't think I'll ever be able to do impertinence because this dungeon already is pretty hard. I did 8 loot run with Escusas uh, not too long ago and yeah so it, it's it's a pretty tough dungeon with the four bosses uh considering eight loot is actually the easiest way to do this now freedom is probably the easiest achievements uh for this if you don't range rape or mp rape shouldn't be too hard <coughs> also uh running it with two pandas is probably the only way to do impertinence with high close combat damage now I still don't know exactly how he put Misery into the middle corner, but it probably has to do something with the fact that I died on turn 1. Um, now you saw on the right side that he uses his Panda and a summon. Um, he basically suicide himself to place the carrions around Corruption. So at this point Corruption is basically locked for the entire fight. Same with Misery. So the only thing that is left for him to do is kill the, um, the summons from Servitude and he basically kills off uh, Corruption first. Now, <clears throat> now you see he basically places a, a bamboo with his panda and then carries the sadi and because he wears a corruption cloak that does poison damage around him at the end of this turn uh, he basically carries himself on the bamboo as well so it's not possible for any monster to hit him plus the fact that he places all these carrions around him by using summons or uh, trees that basically block enemies from getting to him and like you see here there's no possible way for Corruption or war to get to him. Also, corruption and war uh, are, I mean, servitudes. They don't kill the carrions, but because it's basically their own allies. So, basically, Volcasaurus is at this point invulnerable. They cannot hit him at all. Um, so, yeah, basically, for the rest of the fight, he just slowly kills off the uh, enemies one by one. And at the end, uh, war is left. He just goes close combat with war. So yeah, this uh, leech actually cost me 25 uh, million commas. You might think that is that that's a lot of commas. 
Now, because of the three achievements, I got back, I think, like 12, 13 million commas. So this leech actually cost uh, me only about 12 million commas. Which, honestly, if you ask me, isn't too bad, considering these are probably one of the hardest achievements in the entire game. Now, with my road to 20,000 achievements, which I want to finish this year, actually, I want to get 20,000 achievement points before the end of this year. Um, I thought it was quite worth it to pay for this leech. Now, I don't usually pay for a leech. Um, the only dungeon I did pay for a leech as well was Protosaur. Uh, because pretty much for me the most annoying dungeon in the game. Uh, at least for the achievements duo statue. Um, so yeah, like... For, uh, for most of the dungeons in the game, um, like the paper and ink dungeons for example, the Pandala shit. Now, I want to try those myself first before actually paying for a leech, because Volcasaurus is also uh, leeching those dungeons for a uh, pretty good price, uh, considering the resources are pretty high of value as well. And you can, he does all the achievements in run, one run, so you get like, let's say you pay 10 million, you get like 8 million back from resources, uh, you know? So, it's, if you have the commas, like, you might as well uh, buy a leech, you get free achievement points. Now, obviously, I want to get the main achievement points myself, uh, because I don't want everything to get, to be paid, like, you know? But yeah, I think this was uh, really worth it, and... I'm still amazed by the fact that how we he does this dungeon. It's it's amazing. Uh, like I said, it's one of the hardest dungeons in the game, and he basically duos it with a panda and a sadi, and does all the achievements. Like the fact that he duos it is already crazy, and he also does all the achievements in one uh, run. So yeah, it's pretty nice uh, and definitely worth uh, worth doing it. So yeah, just uh, enjoy the rest of the fight, and uh, if you have, a, I will probably link down his channel in the description below. So definitely check out his channel. In my opinion, I think he's probably one of the best, if not the best, PVM players in Dofus. Like the way he does certain certain dungeons, uh, like solo runs and all the achievements in one run. You know, I think he's pretty much like the best player in the game honestly uh, so, oh yeah it's pretty amazing how he does this like he probably practiced this a lot in his free time before he does the leeches like it I think it took him like two weeks after this run to upload his video so maybe he wanted to do like more runs to get this uh, like in a system I don't know but yeah, so uh, enjoy the rest of this fight and I'll uh, see you guys in the next video. If you have any questions about this video, let me know in the comments below. Also, make sure to uh, like the video and don't forget to subscribe because at 500 subscribers we will do uh, a giveaway. So don't forget about that, subscribe. And uh, see you guys in the next video. Bye.